countries and in those uh, address all states of the region have a common uh, starting point uh, in uh, the Soviet Union and uh, it is still quite uh, evident that some tenants of uh, restricting uh, uh, the uh, possibilities uh, of uh, expression as well as association and assembly are present. There is certain continuity, uh, including personal continuity, of uh, the top party leadership, such as syndicates, women's organizations. In all countries in the region, uh, separation of powers is a problem. Uh, in Kyrgyzstan, again, the situation probably would be the best. Uh, but in some others, uh, you can speak about separation of powers when you read normative acts. But when you observe uh, realities, as well as how uh, constitutional provisions are being implemented, then uh, division of powers is questionable. In the question of torture, very much of course. Concerning uh, women and their status, including violence uh, against a woman, women, uh, the situation is quite disturbing in literally all countries. It could vary. Uh, manifestations vary. For example, in Kyrgyzstan, uh, you have among Kyrgyz community about one third of marriages, one third of marriages according uh, to the local UN women. Uh, based on bridal abduction. Most plastic... If uh, there is uh, a torture and uh, 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 excessive use of force against civilians uh, in an attempt uh, to prevent uh, 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 terrorist activities and spillover from Afghanistan, that backfires and that suppression of religious freedoms and uh, human rights in general backfires in sense of uh, efficient uh, fight against terrorism. Thank you very much. Thank you. And thank you too. Have a good noon briefing. <laughs>